After James Webb left us speechless with images of the early universe during the initial stages of its mission, it's now unveiling entirely fresh perspectives of our own solar system. The most recent image of Saturn provides a startlingly new portrayal of the gas giant and its rings, shedding entirely new light on this celestial wonder. Once again, this groundbreaking telescope reveals phenomena that have remained hidden from human eyes until now. Scientists are now confronted with the uncomfortable question of how much they truly understood about our solar system up to this point, and whether Saturn might be fundamentally different from their previous assumptions. Join us on a journey just beyond our cosmic doorstep as we explore the mysteries of our enigmatic neighbor, Saturn. Scientists were well aware that the capabilities of this telescope would be unlike any other before it. It's brought forth images of deep space and captivating cosmic phenomena such as vividly hued nebulae and distant galaxies with unprecedented luminosity and sharpness. Over time, the New Star Telescope is gradually shifting its focus toward the celestial bodies within our own solar system. On June 25, 2023, NASA unveiled a fresh image of the gas giant Saturn, a sight that might have bewildered many amateur astronomers, who could easily have mistaken it for a Saturn-like exoplanet nestled in the farthest corners of the cosmos. Saturn's remarkably altered appearance is the result of the unique technique employed to capture this image. Through the lens of the near-camera instrument on James Webb, familiar objects take on an entirely novel appearance. This isn't just for aesthetic purposes. The use of color filters serves to highlight specific aspects of a planet that would otherwise remain unnoticed when observed in the visible light spectrum. In this new image, Saturn, typically a light gray to brownish hue, appears in dark, mysterious shades while its resplendent ring system gleams brilliantly. James Webb has already cast a whole new light on the other gas giants within our solar system, and Saturn was the final piece of the puzzle. For gas giants in particular, this cutting-edge technology represents a monumental leap forward, as these filters enable precise analyses of surface composition for the very first time. Gaining insight into the intricate ongoings of a planet situated hundreds of thousands of kilometers away isn't a straightforward task. James Webb's cutting-edge technologies are engineered to delve deeper into the activities of gas giants. Unlike visible light, the lengthier wavelengths of infrared light possess the remarkable ability to effortlessly pierce through the dense cloud bands and regions filled with gas and dust. As these waves scatter or get absorbed within the inner layers of gas planets, they unveil the concealed structures within. Consequently, James Webb's infrared cameras are now unveiling myriad aspects of celestial objects that were once shrouded in secrecy. The exploration of Saturn and its celestial companions has embarked upon an entirely novel trajectory, promising us a treasure trove of fresh insights. Beyond unraveling internal structures, infrared light also enables measurements of elements within the gas envelopes. However, it's essential to note that infrared light isn't entirely devoid of interactions. For instance, when it encounters methane gas in Saturn's atmosphere at specific wavelengths, almost all of the light gets absorbed. This is why Saturn appears exceptionally dark in the Webb image, despite the fact that its northern hemisphere was transitioning from its seventh year of summer when the image was taken. This region appears significantly darker when viewed in the infrared spectrum. Scientists are currently endeavoring to decipher the underlying reasons for this phenomenon, which may indicate an undiscovered process within Saturn's atmosphere, possibly leading to the formation of minute particles or aerosols. Conversely, the atmosphere encircling the planet's edges emits a radiant glow in these images. This luminescence could potentially be attributed to methane fluorescence, wherein atoms absorb light and subsequently emit it at entirely different frequencies. Preliminary assessments also suggest that this luminous edge might result from the emissions of trihydrogen ions, abundant in Saturn's upper layers. However, we eagerly await the release of new studies by scientists to provide precise insights into these phenomena. Images of this nature furnish planetary scientists with an abundance of material to delve into, keeping them engaged for months, if not years, as they unravel the mysteries of celestial bodies. What you're looking at here isn't just a single image. 
It's the culmination of an extensive observation process involving the capture of numerous individual images over an extended period. James Webb takes these raw images, obtained using different infrared wavelength filters, and skillfully merges them to create the final composite image. While not all the individual images are currently available, each partial image offers a unique perspective of Saturn's surface and its surroundings. Among the images we can already share with you is one that portrays Saturn as a colossal, luminous flying saucer. This particular image, captured using a near-spectrum wavelength spectrometer, showcases Saturn's distinct cloud bands and the radiant glow of its fluorescent ring, which outshines everything else. Another striking image portrays Saturn almost entirely in black, representing short, near-infrared wavelengths. Each of these images unveils previously unseen details about this exceptional planet, enabling scientists to draw conclusions about previously unknown circumstances. This captivating snapshot is the result of a 20-hour observation mission and presents Saturn as a chocolate brown sphere surrounded by rings that gleam in a vibrant shade of blue. However, these images serve a purpose beyond their aesthetic appeal. The NIR spectrometer filters are designed to delve deep into the mysteries of Saturn's moons and rings. During several days of observing Saturn with the James Webb Telescope, Numerous other measurements were collected using James Webb's mid-infrared instrument, MIRI. Currently, these images remain undisclosed, fueling anticipation within the fan community, which eagerly awaits fresh impressions of Saturn. NASA strategically stages James Webb's missions and the release of its latest images, leveraging the curiosity and interest of millions on Earth. Image releases are spaced out over several weeks and are typically limited in number. This approach is understandable, as both NASA and the involved scientists aim to ensure that James Webb remains a valuable scientific instrument rather than an overwhelming source of constant new data. The public release of these images is carefully orchestrated to inspire, intrigue, and foster increased interest in space exploration. The newest and most advanced space observatory is, in essence, a fully-fledged scientific laboratory situated deep in space. After years of construction, this telescope is finally providing the images and measurements that scientists have long yearned for. Now let's refocus our attention on Saturn. Not too long ago, Webb graced us with a strikingly similar image of Jupiter a sight that left amateur astronomers equally astonished as they had never witnessed the solar system's largest and most jovial planet in such a manner before. Infrared technology unveiled structures that, astonishingly, share a remarkably similar form in Saturn's northern regions. In both cases, scientists suspect that gravitational waves may be interacting with aerosols in the upper atmosphere, giving rise to these intriguing patterns. The focal points of these images, undoubtedly, are the rings and the moons, including Dione, Enceladus, and Tethys. Set against Saturn's dark backdrop in this image, the rings take center stage, resembling the true superstars of the composition. Despite decades of intensive research, Saturn's rings remain an enigmatic feature that continues to captivate the curiosity of both scientists and ordinary enthusiasts. In this new image, they appear as luminous, substantial horizontal bands, with various rings seemingly converging into three prominent main rings. Through missions like Cassini, astronomers have ascertained that these rings consist of a complex mixture of dust, rock, and ice particles, ranging in size from minuscule grains akin to grains of sand to substantial rock chunks towering like tall mountains. The origins of this rocky material and its relationship to the formation of Saturn's numerous moons remain among the paramount questions in the field of astronomy. In the case of the ice ring, however, the Cassini mission, spanning almost two decades, clarified the matter. Fascinating images unveiled that the icy moon Enceladus expelled substantial quantities of ice particles, projecting them 9,600 kilometers into the surrounding region during violent volcanic eruptions, effectively contributing to the formation of the ring system. It's just the beginning. 
A year after its launch, the James Webb mission remains in its nascent stages. This roughly $11 billion telescope is poised to shine as the superstar of the night sky for at least a decade, with its operation anticipated to extend even further. As we conclude this video, we'd love to hear your thoughts. Do you appreciate these entirely fresh insights on Saturn? Are you equally fascinated by the technical capabilities of the telescope as you are by the pure beauty of the cosmos? Share your perspective in the comments below. We're eager to hear from you.